Hello and welcome to day two of Aberdeen Asset Management Cows Week. It's Sunday, it's going to be another tricky day on the water, just like yesterday. But among those who did very well yesterday and won their class is this boat here, Ascent, the Contessa 32, sailed by the Rogers family. They'll be looking to repeat that performance because today is family day. Meanwhile, I'll be sailing an XOD, one of the classic boats of Cows Week. I'm loving it here at the Cows Parade Village, bringing my pirate swashbuckle show to town, and it's a great turnout. I've had loads of people coming today. It's been absolutely amazing. I haven't been back to Isle of Wight since I was little, so it's a really nice treat to come back. I think it's really great for people to come down with their children and to get involved with the entertainment as well, because it's not just for the kids, it's kind of for the adults as well. <laughs> We're the Rogers family, part of the Rogers family. So Simon and Kit are Jeremy Rogers' son. I think the last time I sailed with Simon in Cowsweet was probably about 20 years ago. So it's a, it's a it's quite a quite a special day. We've been in, in boats all our lives. My father started in the 60s, and for me and Kit particularly, you know, it's uh, you know we, we've been laughing all day uh, and and just passing on as much as we can to the kids. Hopefully, hopefully they'll enjoy it and sort of pass that on to the next generation. It's really good because. I get to learn how to sail like them and hopefully by the end I'll be better. <laughs> not better than us though? No, not better than <laughs> you but... <laughs> I'm Charlie, I've been, uh, we're sailing in Alice which is a squib. I'm sailing with my brothers Tom and Harry today, we're triplets. Sailing with our brothers it's more sort of relaxed because you know if you, when you come off the water you're not going to still be moaning at them or something. It's definitely. Uh, cooperating well is quite a difficult thing sometimes. Getting it right, listening as well, because we all want to do our own thing, but obviously we've got to listen. We want to finish around mid-fleet, but it's going to be a challenge considering the amount of good sailors that are in our fleet. It's a great atmosphere out on the water, and when you come back everyone's all friends and everything, even if you didn't have a good time. It's just really good. Of all of the one design classes in the Solent, the fleet that really stands out is the XOD fleet. It's consistently the biggest fleet out here throughout the summer. It's a remarkable boat and I've been sailing today with James McGill and Jay Devonshire on their uh, XOD and we had a fantastic time. But the, the question on my mind, James, is why is the XOD such a popular boat? First, it's a one design. It can accommodate any age. I started in this boat, funny enough, at age 14. Um, and out there, we have people from 80 down to 15, 20. I think the other, the other big factor for the class is that it's it sailed in five different locations. It's a club race class. And the club fleets are the strength of it. We come together at Cow's Week as a, as a championship. Because you sail as, a, as a, a class in a club, Everybody knows each other, people stand the behaviour is better, the camaraderie is better. There's a huge kudos we're doing well in the next oh, yeah. isn't it? Oh, it's is a high standard. A tough fleet to yeah. say. They're tough on the water and nice on the shore. So, once again, Family Day was a huge success. Now, tomorrow, I'm sailing this boat, a brand new Grand Prix 40 footer. I am seriously excited about this. But there's another twist to this. This is owned by the man who's behind Ben Ainsley Racing. He's also the man who brought us the Olympics in 2012. It's Sir Keith Mills. There's going to be a lot to talk about. 